just normal people who grabbed guns and went down there and stared down Russian tanks in 2014, and they've fought for eight years. And so their their courage, uh, their their unbending faith in this dream, and the fact that they've never given up after all these years, yeah, it's it's really inspiring for me. And I I you know I it's probably what kept me here. And you know. You know, not even just the young people too, but my my mother-in-law and my father-in-law grew up in the Soviet Union. My father-in-law is a Soviet Army veteran, you know, and he's the most patriotic pro-American pe- person you ever meet in the world right now. Anyway, just to see our best attributes. That's you know, it, man. I love it. That, that's going to be the American dream in action. Is it's yeah. not the American dream anymore? It's it's kind of a global dream, and it's maybe it is. even even more embodied. Like the American dream 2.0 is the Ukrainian dream. 